Hey everybody, it's Blake here from a YouTuber's Guide to Surviving Life, bringing you a brand new video. And today, I thought it would be a good idea to do yet another reaction video to a trailer for an upcoming movie that a lot of people have been talking about, and that is Cars 3. Now, I thought the whole Cars franchise was dead after they started making those terrible plane movies, but actually, apparently not. So, I'm actually kind of relieved because, you know, Cars 3 was a really good and really favorite movie of mine. Let's get right into this. And I gotta say, so far, these graphics are really, really good. Like, look at the way, like, the textures inside of them and stuff, and actually how futuristic they're making the cars now. Uh... Okay, so I guess... After years of waiting for another Cars movie, they introduce us a character that we don't know or care about. Like, you'd figure if it's been such a long time before they've you've seen another Cars movie, they'd introduce Lightning McQueen or Tomater or some other lovable character. But no, there's this one guy. I actually was a little bit scared for a second, because I thought that was Lightning McQueen. I was seriously, I would not have saw the film if they changed him that much. Like, come on. Okay, what? Come on, like, we're already halfway- we're more than halfway through the trailer! Where are we gonna see some actual characters we wanna see? Could, like, really? <laughs> why did they show the logo twice? Why- why? FINALLY! Or I'm gonna say this again, this is some really good graphics. I wouldn't be surprised if they were actually not even animating this, and this was just them taking actual car and videotaping, because this looks so real. And again, they're going to show the logo. Wait, that's it? That's it? They just show two other cars we don't know or care about, and then they show Lightning McQueen finally, and it's over? This is not a Cars trailer, this is more of a freaking introduction to some 2017 PS4 racing game. That's it, guys. I don't I don't want to make this video suck so much for you guys, because this trailer was terrible. I'm going to go look up another one that probably actually introduces some of the plot of the movie, and not just a bunch of showcasing. Why didn't I start off with this one? This one looks really good. And there's that other douchey car that took up one third of the last trailer that none of us care about. What's the actual crap? Like. What? This- Could you imagine- That's- This is basically, in a car's perspective, a rated R movie slasher film. Look, holy crap, that is- This is a really rough way to be introduced back into the car's world and not that crappy plane's world. Like, come on. You will never be the racer you once were. Accept it. Will Lightning McQueen retire? I decide when I'm done. Holy god, dude. This is way too dramatic for a Cars movie. Like, really, 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 this is not at all what it was before. Like, if you look back at the first Cars trailer, then it will not be nearly as serious and crazy as it is right now. Like, what is this? 
What? It's basically our character just got ripped into shreds and now has to recover with freaking cra crazy cinematic cinematic views of like just everything we known out of all three movies just tear up, like just torn up. Like, come on, what is this? I'm coming for you, Storm. Alright, so it's over now, but I only got really one complaint, I guess, besides the overly dramatic film. Where is Tomator? Where is Radiator Springs? That's the exact- that's like half the entire movie. Where is- like, that's just- it's just Mike and McQueen. It's- it, that's- that's it. He's gonna at least have one saying in it. Like, Tomator was like the second-hand character, but he's not in there. Really? I feel like such an idiot right now, because I'm 14 already. And I'm just ra rambling about a Cars movie for ten. That's probably for ten-year-olds. But now that I think, now but now that I look at it, it appears that they're probably not trying to appeal it to ten-year-olds as much as they're trying to appeal it to freaking psychopathic car destroyers. But look at that! I just, I just can't even get over this. This is, this is unreal. But no, guys. Hope you guys like this video. It really means a lot to me if you guys leave a like. Subscribe, all that other stuff. Leave a comment, tell me if you're actually looking forward to the new Cars movie, because I am kind of a little bit. But no, guys, thank you for watching, and peace out.